Yes, we are back. Back again in Train Sim World 2. Back again for another first look at a new line. Well, to me, it's been out a while. But it's my first look at it, which is why it's a first look. Because it's my first look. Uh, the um, Munich... München, 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 München. This one. What it says on the screen there. Uh, Munich to Augsburg. I'm probably pronouncing that completely wrong. Uh, which is a high-speed uh, German thing. Because I've not looked at it before. So it's my first look. I may have mentioned that once or twice, possibly. Um, so that's what we're going to be doing uh, for this one. If you're watching this on the YouTube, then hello. I, I was waving then. Must stop doing that. Uh, this going out on YouTube on uh, Railway Wednesday. It's a thing. Uh, sometimes on a Monday there's some OMSI. Sometimes on a Friday there's something else. And then first looks at new things on a Sunday. That's that out of the way. Uh, Stu, thank you very much indeed uh, for the bits. And hello to Dylan, uh, Trent, Maeve and uh, Stu. Uh, so yes, uh, we may as well just click on it then. Don't we? And just get on with it. Rather than just sit waffling about it. Just get on. Just get on with it. That's what you want, isn't it? You don't want to just, just get on with it. It's what you're sat there saying. You're just saying, just get on with it. I, I did that. It's getting on with it. Welcome to the word. Munich to Augsburg. Augsburg? Munchen. Munchie. Munchies. Oh, hang on. The reset track IR. Welcome to Train Sim World 2, the immersive and highly detailed rail simulation featuring authentic routes and trains from around the world. Press E to begin. Okay. You've just been awarded some action points. Ooh. These are displayed in the top right corner of the screen and count towards your overall experience. Okay. It is necessary to be fully observant of the surrounding world. Practice by looking up, down, left, and right. That was a noise. Uh, up. Uh, down. Uh, left, or sort of up left, and sort of across to the right over there a little bit. Did I have to invert my axis? No! Besides operating trains, there are lots of requirements to navigate on foot. Try moving around now. I can try moving around. I've tried it. Hello, where are you going? I'm just going to walk around here. Oh, I'll, move, I'll walk up here then. Doesn't feel very busy, does it? Not far. Excuse me, I'm just going to walk behind you. Punctuality is not my strong point. Punctuality isn't my strong point. Neither is the German signalling system, which can't be any worse than the French signalling system. This is one of many interactives to be discovered, but not all of them will be as easy to find as this one. Oh, that's where we're going, let's see. From from there to, to, to there. That's the thing. Uh, anyway, going down here. I'm just walking to various places on the map. Oh, it's all the way. Why can't they sort of set me down here with the distance? Why can't I just put one in all the way down the end there? Where am I going now? Down there? Okay. Started early? No. I does. Now where am I going now? Why is there an egg timer? Am I, am I boiling an egg? Grundig. Is uh, this uh, train station sponsored by Grundig? Is that a thing? Why am I walking all the way down here? Is this walking simulator? Hi oh, Michael. Oh, it's a train. I see a train, a train. Well, why am I walking down here then if a train's going to go back down there? I'm going to be away from it. Ice, ice, baby. Um, excuse me. I, I'm, I'm stood here. Why have you gone all the way down there? That was a noise. Where are you trying to get me? Oh, well, back Latin now. Enter the lead carriage. Oh, it could be lead carriage. It might be quite heavy. Do, 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 do. Hopefully they're not expecting a fast turnaround here. This station sponsored by Grundig. Doobie doobie doo. I'm just going to walk slowly. I should really be get doing the getting inside the train, shouldn't I? Should I be doing that? Should we do that? Let's do that. Ow. Some steps there. Oh, that's a bit flash, isn't it? Press E to get in that available seat. 
that one. You can pause the experience at any point and review previous and current objectives. Check it out now, then return to the game when ready. Uh, Wednesday's good. I paused, I unpaused. Follow the marker to the staff door. I just sat down. Okay. That was quite funky. Why is it doing that? Open the staff door and into the cab. Oh, that's a bit front. A lot of time will be spent operating trains. So when ready, sit in the driver's seat. I managed to squeeze right little gap there, didn't I? Should, uh, a heads up display has appeared on the right side of the screen. How thin this I am. This is a guide to what the train is doing. What? Right. This is the speed display. The current speed will be represented by a moving bar. The red marker indicates the current maximum permitted speed. Okay. There's some guy talking to me in German. This is the direction display. An arrow will indicate forward, reverse, and neutral directions. Okay. Oh, press E, that's me. This is the power display. A number will indicate what position the power control is in. Forward. These are brake indicators. They show the state of the various brake systems, allowing independent management of them. Lots of pressing E. In the top right are the signal and speed limit displays. These feature an indication of what is approaching and a countdown distance to when they will come into effect. Okay. Some of these displays can be hidden via the settings menu for a more challenging experience. No, 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 no. This train is ready to go. Push the indicated handle all the way forward to get moving. I've done that. It did say push it all the way forward. Should I have to release the brakes or anything? I'm not even. Mention Central Station is the southern tip of a high speed rail network providing fast, efficient travel all over Germany. I'm not moving. This particular train features eight cars. Each one moving. has traction motors located between the axles for woman. a lighter, faster, and more efficient I, I, operation. Shh, I'm, I'm not moving, woman. You forgot to tell me to do something. Doors? Well, why didn't tell me to put the power thing in the all the way of the power thing? That was a noise. She told me to put the power thing in the powery forward place. Now I'm moving. There's movement. That's that's definitely a, a noise that's happening. She's now left me alone. What am I supposed to be doing now? Is she going to tell me to do something else? Is that just, that's, that's it? She's going to go, yep, yeah, you're all fine now. Didn't tell me to close the doors. Didn't tell me to do the breaky off thing. Didn't tell me to put it in forward. Just, you know, I just... They don't see me try and drive a train before. Oh, God, we're in the, the KMHs as well, aren't we? That's going to be a, a thing. So maximum speed of uh, the 130 KMHs in uh, 600 uh, meters. Oh, that was some stuttering, stuttering, stuttering. I'm driving an ice train. What's Intercity Express, isn't it? Train Sim World 2 allows you to ride and drive from an internal and external viewpoint. Let's take a look now while this train is in motion. I just did that, but okay. I can use the keys to look around. Ice, ice, baby. Actually quite a good, uh, that's a better screenshot. Thumbnail, nailed it. 
she's still is she giving up on me again I think she's giving up on me again oh hang on you've only explored a small area here so let's take a look at what else there is to enjoy okay Welcome to Bavaria in southern Germany. That's not loud. Climb aboard both international and local trains that service a highly modern multi-track railway. Race along at up to 230 kilometers an hour operating under the control of the LZB signaling system. Oh god. And keep the traveling public moving with the high capacity BR423 S-Bahn trains. Ooh. Sleek express or mass transit, you're in the driver's seat. Along the way, don't forget to place route maps. No. Nope. Install bicycle maintenance points. No. Nope. Maintain trackside equipment. No. And repair damaged emergency telephones. No, no. Train sim. This is Halbstrecker Munchen. Train Ashburn. sim. Not repair simulator. Train sim. World 2. Yes, track IR does work in the cab. And when you're walking around as well. But I just turn it off because it confuses me. Well, when walking around in the cab, it's fine. I've got that. I should really do something on that, shouldn't I? Maybe one day. What's it going to do now? What are you going to do... You're going to load something else now, aren't you? Are you going to load something else now? You might not. I've got that as well. I'm not leaning on that. Oh, we've got another train. Okay. Are you going to tell me how not to drive this one like you did with the other one? Welcome to driver training here at Munchen Passing. Today, you'll be learning to drive this BR423 electric multiple unit in DB traffic red livery. This brief introduction will cover critical driving controls and passenger operations. Climb aboard to get started. Board. I can't climb aboard because some clown's door shut. Hello. I, well, I'm not supposed to be letting you off. I'm supposed to be getting on. Excuse me. I'm just going to... Uh, that, that's interesting. Seating. What a weird. Take a seat in the driver's position. This is where you'll be spending. Oh. To activate the control desk, insert the reverser. Uh, yeah, it does work inside. So yeah, track IR does work. I just, I'm so used to using the mouse with this. What am I doing? Insert a what? Into where? Insert the reverse key. Did that. The reverser is used to set the direction of travel. Neutral. Forward. Take a quick glance of the platform to ensure all is safe, then unlock the doors. Yeah, I glanced up there, it's alright. Passengers are doing the getting on and off thing. Well, mainly getting off rather than getting on. That's a horn. It's time to get going. Set the doors to locked. Uh, have I just done? Okay. Oh, that's not annoying at all. I've done that. I've done that. I've done... I did that. I'm just going to go now? Okay. 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 Oh, yes, apparently. That's making a noise. Okay, so I already prefer this over the ice train. Oh, what's it want me to do? Uh, close passenger doors. I did that. From here, you will be guided to the next station stop, Munchen Line. From where? This I multiple unit features a combined power brake handle I know. and the master controller. Yep, yeah, I've already used that. It's currently in the brake range. No, it's not. Move the handle past the off position and into the power range to get moving. I, I've already moved. Coasting is a method used to efficiently maintain speed and reduce engine stress. And I'm coasting. I'm already ahead of you there. I'm, I'm coasting. I'm doing the coasting thing. Keeping to the speed limit is important. Is it? If you begin to overspeed, move the master controller into the braking range to slow down. Okay, I haven't quite got that far yet, but I'll just go into the forward acceleratory. Hello, hello train. Stop at Munchen Liam. Lime. Munchen Lime. Not Liam. Oh, 
Okay, can't see where I'm going now. Right, so single lever operation. So one lever does the brake and the acceleratory thing. Uh, there will be some links in the doobly-doo below for those watching on YouTube that have got this far. Uh, one way you can uh, get this uh, route for uh, the Train Sim World 2. Uh, one to where you can watch this madness live on Twitch, because apparently I'm stupid enough to do this six days a week. Uh, and one to join a Discord server which is full of complete and utter maniacs. Uh, tomorrow night, for those watching live... Apply a small amount of brake force to achieve a comfortable, safe stop. Uh, farming. Uh, then Friday night we've got some American trucking, uh, Saturday lunchtime uh, some tourist bus, Saturday night uh, more farming, and then uh, Sunday lunchtime uh, more power wash simulator because that was just extremely good last week. Right, into our station we come. It is looking quite nice actually, this map. I am liking it already. First impressions are good. Apart from the camera does that. Less of the braking. That's root, not Groot. Root as in uh, route, not root as in Groot. Exactly. Right, braking. More of the braking. It's some of, some of the braking. That'll do. That's, that's close enough, I think. Take a quick glance of the platform to ensure all is safe, then unlock the doors. Yeah, it's fine. Why? What? what? Why am I. No, don't stop bringing it. Wow, that's a lot of people that are getting off and jumping, standing about there. What? What is going on with the people? So we're just all going to get off and stand here on the platform. I think there's some issues here with the uh, <laughs> the AI. They just stand it. They get off the train and just stand there. Nope, we're not going anywhere. We're just going to stand here. We're going to we're going to wait here until the next train comes, and we're just going to get back on that. It's time to get going. Set the doors to locked. That's definitely a noise. I've done, where am I going? Okay, I'll just go then, I suppose. Definitely a delay between applying the power and actual movement. No, it does sound good. I do like a train with a good bit of audio. Right, we've got a yellow in 600 metres. So, I shall back off the power in case that then becomes a red. Well, not the yellow becomes a red, in case the one after the yellow is a red. Don't be red, please don't be red, please don't be red. It's green, we're okay. It hasn't told me where I'm going. So I didn't bother stopping at that one. Past signal at danger. It was no it was green. Wasn't it? <laughs> it was definitely green. I I it was no, it did, because it was said it was green. The speed limit was doing the limity thing to say the green thing. I wasn't actually sure if I should be stopping at that station. I don't want to do the introduction thing again. Okay, let's... No, don't do that. Uh, let's go back to the main me, me and you, then. I think I meant to stop there. It didn't tell me, did it? Uh, right, tools. No, not tools. Explore. 
training. Uh, then the ice. We don't need to train the ice train. Uh, scenario. Wash and go. Ice trouble. Commuter confusion. Uh, wash and go. Prepare only one ice service for its duties to bring onto service. Let's do that one then. We shall wash it. <laughs> wash and go. Isn't that the shampoo stuff with the conditioner built in? And a green uh, bottle thing. Wash and go. Wash and go. Welcome to music, Munich, music. Welcome to Munich, Leyem Depot. You'll be taking this BR four hundred three I three set to Augsburg. First, you prepare the train for departure towards Munich. You'll be running via the train wash. What? What train? Oh, that one. I say. I've got a link. Okay. Oh look, a little step comes out. That's quite cool. Must have got. How the hell did I get up there? Oh, come on. Okay, that was a long way up. I should lock the door, shouldn't I? Lock the door. Should we, should we lock the, can we lock the door? Can we lock the? Can we do, do, lock the door? Wait, why? What? The door is closed. Sit in the driver's. Ow! There's a window there. Sit in the driver's seat. It's it's going well. Uh, okay, let's. Um, there we go. Set a direction to forward. Done that. Set headlights to normal. Parking brake to release. I, I did that. I've done that. I've, 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 I did. That. Oh, that one down there. Okay. Okay. Apply some power. Power! Go via the train wash. It's definitely a long one. Two and a half kilometres to the train wash. You'd think they'd either move the train wash here or park the train closer, wouldn't you? So this is going to be a full line run then, all the way down to uh, Augsburg. Have we got a thing horn? Oh, we have. That's quite cool. Alright, five kilometres an hour in 2.3 of the things. Get the power washer out. That's uh, Sunday. The other one sounds nicer. Doesn't look that dirty either, does it? Alright, it's so gotta be careful of the speed. I don't want to be done for the speeding thing. So I wonder how many stops it will be then from when we get to um, past the pressure washery place. Because surely the other train is going to be a one that's going to go to all the stations. So this one's going to be a, it's just going to be a non-stop run? I don't know. I'm guessing we'll find out once we've washed it. I think they put the depot closer to Munich, but I'm guessing they can't. Dwayne! It's the only thing with Train Team World 2, isn't it? You get these, occasionally the, the graphics freak out. 
Saw that. Which is a, uh, an unreal thing, I think. It does look nice. It's, it's a train. Because, you know, because the, it is. Right, 1k until we trundle through the train wash. So, don't quite understand the German signaling system. I can see a green one there, so we just pretend we didn't see any of the others. It's telling me green up in the top right, but that could just be lying. Or oh, we got a red in 1.6k. And also in the speeding thing. All the brakes aren't very effective. Stopping this thing could be interesting. Right, 400 meters, we've got to do, be doing 5 kmh. That's quite slow. That's going to be very slow, in fact. In fact, it's going to be 5 kmh. Oh, that's... That, Seems like someone's drowning a bee. Because <laughs> that's what drowning a bee sounds like. <laughs> it is a very musical train. Alright, so there's the train wash we got to be going under. Five kmh is our required speed. It's always be really difficult not to actually stop the flipping thing. I can see if we have got to stop at any stations en route, we're going to be overrunning. Wow, this is like slow. doing 5.9. Don't want to be doing that. We are going into a train wash, I suppose. We do 230 kmh as our top speed. What's that? It's 100 is 60, 200 is going to be 120. Uh, that's only going to be about what, 150 miles an hour? That's not exactly fast fast is it because i mean we got diesels in in the uk that run 125 miles an hour that's a noise what about the front what cleans the front then? So the sides get nice and clean. We've got a front bit. Right, I still got. F I still got to do five miles an hour. Kilometers an hour. I'm speeding. So we've got to stop in 600 meters. I 
the hell is this we're going into now? Uh, some sort of train drying device? It's a bit strange. I hope we get to go faster than this on the way down to Augsburg. Otherwise, it's going to... Well, 55 minute scenario at this speed. Not a very long distance, is it, between Munich and Augsburg? Oh, I'm getting washed again. Yep, still haven't washed the front of the train, though, have they? I think there'd be one that go, you know, up the pointy bit. Because you've got to keep the end of it clean. <laughs> it's been waxed yet. No, not yet. I will have a dirty roof. And the bit I look out of, okay, the wiper will clean sort of that bit. But what about the rest of it? Oh, stop at Munich in 1.4k. Okay, well, that's good. Well, we got a green now. Hang on, we haven't got to do five kilometres an hour for the next one kilometre, surely. I suppose I know the rest of the train is now going through the wash. Oh, that's not freaking out at all. Yeah, don't change view when it's inside the... <coughs> When it's inside the wash, it gets confused. I want to go fast. I don't want to be doing five kilometers an hour. Well, it still didn't clean my pointy bit. Well, I suppose passengers won't necessarily see that. It's more about the windows, I suppose. They will complain if they can't see out the windows. So I've still got 300 metres to go until I get to a... Th well, actually, no, because when the back of the train goes through the speed limit change is when I'll actually get to increase the speed. So I'm going to be stuck at this until the rear goes through. And we've got to stop down there. Is it back through yet? Nearly. Oh, it doesn't like that, does it? It, <laughs> it doesn't like that at all. So yeah, the train's still... Uh, don't you come on here speaking French, 04? We're in Germany. <laughs> this is the slowest approach. We oui, baguette. Croque monsieur. Jambon. Le petit fromage. Oh, I can speed up. Hey, right. Guten Tag, Herr Dillon. Dillon. 
Das ist mein Glockenspiel. That's about all I can say in German. The fact that I did German for GCSE. I've forgotten most of it. Right, 30 limit now. Now the train's finally out of the uh, train wash. <laughs> you like football? Really? Oh, that was the horn. So we got to go to Munich. Uh, and that's it. No passengers. Go to Munich. Go to Augsburg. What? Hang on a minute. So we've got to stop at Munich. Load the passengers. Shut the cab down. Chain, go to the other end. Load passengers. Stop at Munich. Pacing. Then stop at Augsburg. Hang on, so Munich to Augsburg is... What's that? 30 minutes. That's not very... Okay, this is quite a quick train, I suppose. But still, 30 minutes ain't very long. Right, we've got to work out the braking thing now. This could be interesting. 1A? 1A doing anything? 1A is not doing a lot. Oh, it's doing something. Train brake 1B. So you've got 1B pushing the train outside, flying in reverse, pushing the train. Yep, 1B, that'll do it. I don't know what an A is. A... a a better qualified B. Ah, he's only a B. I'm an A. Alright, can we come into uh, Munich? See, that's the thing, it's just weird with trains in world. Is that? <laughs> yeah, stop doing that. That's close enough. Unlock doors. One's on the right. Now change ends, prepare the camp for westbound running. Didn't have to do anything this end then, was that it? I just get up? Okay, I'll just get up. Don't, what? What was that? Okay, it turned around on its own. Stop doing that with a view. Hang on, apply the parking, hang on. Wait, wait a minute, wait a minute. Hold the, hang on. I didn't do as I was told, did I? Bear with me. Oh, I better sit down again. <laughs> the brakes to release. Headlights to uh, dimmed. Uh, reverse it to off. Uh, head to the other end. I, w I would have known that when it got all the way down to the other end. Hang on, I bet shut that door for anybody gets in there. Tries to steal the train. We close that. Should we close that door? Are they going to close automatically? It might close automatically. We'll go down here anyway. Hello, passengers. I'm with you soon. Once I've worked out how to get it working again. It's a long walk down here. I should get the train. This station is still sponsored by Grundig. Head to the rear of the train. Is it still technically the rear of the train? I suppose it is until I've changed directions. 
then that becomes the front of the train and where I was just sat at the front of the train it becomes the rear of the train. If I change directions again, where I was then sat at the front of the train becomes the rear of the train, the other end becomes the front of the train because it's no longer the rear of the train because the rear of the train is now the front of the train. get on board. We dark in here, isn't it? Oop. Okay, sit down. I've sat down. Uh, that into the forward mode. That into the normal. Release parking brake. Lock doors. Okay, Munich and the distance. We're moving, I might have set that up right then. Right, so 7.2k to Munich pacing. One's about, one's up and down. <laughs> it's definitely a noise. It's definitely a noise. Right, off we go. Let's uh, hopefully we get a full speed. Well, we're going to have to, I suppose full speed run in the in the thing being the full speed thing in the full speed thing being that it's going to be a full speed right do the coasting thing so we've already got to stop here at Munich pacing and then all the way down to Augsburg And I'm guessing there'll be a scenario in the other train. I quite like that because it made more noise. Although this isn't bad. Wiper. Wiper off. Wiper speed. Okay. Why would you need to... Okay. Right. 300 uh, meters. And uh, can go to 130 of the Ks. How many other trains around is there? There's another train there back in the Munich place. We got passed by a couple, or we passed a couple. There were a couple near us when we were going through the, uh, the train wash. Right, just wait for the whole train to go through that, then and we'll get the increase. There's a train. Because, you know, it's a train. You can tell that because well, it is. Well, it's two trains. Well, it's one train, technically, but it's made up of two trains. Right, let's give it the beans. So 130k limit now. Wow, it's, okay, that's picking up a bit of speed. Uh, hi Aaron, doing good, thank you. Twain. So I'm guessing it's going to be after this stop then we're going to get a full line high speed run. So 
So three and a half K, we're down to a 60. It's not running that smoothly. It's not bad. A little bit jittery and juddery. I'm driving a train made purely of ice. You can only drive in the winter, no good in the summer. So I don't know at what point I should really start slowing down to get down to that 60. sometime between now and when I need to be at it, I'm guessing. Yeah, it's a yellow as well. Oh, it's covered that distance okay. Okay, more of the braking. Wow, okay, the brake's quite good. Well, else, this must be near where we started then. No, it wasn't 7k away, was it, from the um, train wash? coming up. Hi, Singer. Right, so stop here and then we should get to give it all of the beans. So why does the speedo go to 350 then? If we're going to do 2.30. Oh, stop doing that with the view. Driving under the speed limit. I am good. Definite squeaky brakes. Right, unlock doors. So one now. Who's the trolley dog on this service? Uh, we haven't got one. We are trolley dollyless. Hans. So light is red. You can't go anywhere anyway until that light uh, turns to another colour, like a nice blue or something. So then we've got, well, we started Munich, we're ending in Augsburg, so this is going to be a full line run then, which it said it's half an hour from here to Augsburg. No, I didn't pass signal at danger. Nope, wasn't me. Didn't do it, can't prove anything. May have slightly been me. Well, he gave up on me. It wasn't telling me what to do. It's like, nope, on you go. You're on your own now. It's a long time to load these passengers, isn't it? See, there's none getting on. Ausgang. Not no mouse farting here then. Is it a place my orange squash? There's a cup holder there, look. So yeah, there is a cup holder. Uh, is it on that side? No, there's only one cup holder on, on your left. It's good, because that's where I keep my orange squash, on my left. The 
lock doors. Right, we can go. Release the brakey. To replace my jelly babies. Uh, you can probably put them up on here. Or over there. Right, 49 kilometers. It's not a very really long run then, is it? So 49, so what's that? I've done seven. So 56 kilometers between Augsburg and Munich. What's that in miles? 40 miles, something like that? Not a really long bit of distance, isn't it? No smoking. No, no smoking. So we should then get to do, hopefully, a full 34.7 miles. Wow, that's probably one of the shortest <laughs> routes they've done then, isn't it? Right, speed of me going up, 160 kilometers an hour. So put the aircon on. Yeah, we don't need that. Right, will we then get faster horn? I'm trying to concentrate on this. Well, that's 153. We have double hornage on this one. Right, 200 in four kilometers, okay. We well, yeah, this, so it's not a very long line. The train's not that fast, is it? Say 100 kilometers an hour is 60. 200 kilometers an hour is 120 miles an hour. So our HST, quicker than that. It's quite cool. So we should get to do the full 230, I'm guessing. So that's the other train you can drive. I quite like that for the short distance we had. We'll see if we've got time to do a uh, scenario in that after this one. We should have. Well, yeah, the top speed it was allowed to go at, they they would they could have run faster, but um, that was the maximum line speed. Because of the corners and stuff. That's why the um, well the APT was designed before the HST. Right, come on. Right, so that's now giving me 200. What's the speed of the London, the, the Faversham thingy, the thingy? The high speed thingy. That's more than that, isn't it? Oh, 
Alright, that's 198. Come on, you've got to give us more speed. Right, 230 in 3.9, 140 miles an hour for London Famisham. Is that all? Which is faster than this. I'm liking it though, it's different. Hundred and eighty six, that's probably kilometers then, isn't it? So yeah. Yeah. Hundred and eighty six miles an hour. Wow, okay. So yeah, faster than this. Where is the uh, the line infrastructure is uh, the restricted uh, thing on this? Where there's any bends that they can't run faster, right? So we've now got 230. Give it the beans, all of them. Hi, Hillsman. many of the beans two two five two two six two two seven Two thirty, slight bit of speeding. Yeah, I definitely wasn't at King's Cross Station today. All right, so hopefully now it keeps me at this speed for a while. Yeah, only 30 minutes though between Augsburg and uh, the place we've just been. Looked like me. Definitely wasn't me. What? You sure it wasn't George Clooney then? Because we're often you know, mistaken for each other. Well, that's the one, Nico. All right, it's got to keep going on that speed in the top right. Yeah. <laughs> that's George Clooney with Ginger. Uh, I can ban you, Dylan. You do know that. Um... I was going to say, yeah, I've, I've been under the, the, the channel tunnel in the train by getting on it at um, to Folkestone. I've never been from London. Or been on the passenger one. Been on the vehicle one, not the passenger one. Right, so there's the slow train on our left. Bit of solar. IDP rail. So yeah, tomorrow night back with some farming. Uh, Friday night is then going to be uh, some American trucking. Uh, Saturday lunchtime we'll be doing some tourist bus. Uh, Saturday night will be more farming. Uh, Sunday afternoon, uh, more power washing. And then uh, next week, uh, things. So yeah, I suppose it is covering the distance quite 
well. I just didn't think it was this close for distance between Munich and Augsburg, Augsburg, the, the place. I was considering becoming a railway conductor or, en or engineer, but I got put off by all the training. There are any intermediate stations then that we're whipping? Oh, there is. There's one there. Say that we're whipping through. So the only reason this scenario is actually taking as long as it did then is because of the whole train wash thing. If it would have just gone from Munich straight down. It would have been a fairly quick scenario. I'm guessing there is one that just involves just going between A and B. But yeah, I'm liking it. It's quite nice just doing something like this occasionally. And I'm sort of enjoying Train Sim World too at the moment as well. Perhaps we'll do some more next week. All right, only 19k away from Augsburg. Yeah, it's definitely uh, covering the distance yeah, quickly, but say not as quickly as I would like. I'd like it like more speed, more power. A little bit of rattle to the audio. It's like it's like there's a screw loose behind my head. Screw loose in my head, not behind my head. Yeah, I probably won't bother with that, Hillsman. Right, at what point then is it going to start slowing me down? I reckon at 5k out, maybe. So yeah, we'll do this one, and then we're going to drive the other train, which is the little red thing, because that's what it's called. There's the, the pointy one made out of ice, and there's the little red thing. And then next week, I think we'll go and drive something old and blue and diesel, just to you know balance it out. little red train called James. It's quite sad that you know that, Nico. He was a big fan. Uh -huh. Was this last year or something like that? Year before, maybe? Imagine doing this run in a pacer. I really hope they bring a pacer to Train Sim World last month. Oh, fair play. Right, we're only 9k away. Yeah, the original Thomas Tank Engine was fine, but the remade bloody stupid thing now, like Postman Pat. No! Postman Pat does not have a heli helicopter. He's got a little red van. That's it. Right, 
right, 150 in uh, 1.9k. So we'll start putting a little bit of breakage on. Okay, a lot of breakage on. Slight bit of speeding. Right, and then down to a ninety. So yeah, so the slow line's running along to our left, the other side of that little wall. go already passed like one other train going the other way not a bad route definitely thought it would be longer no. Keep those thoughts to yourself. Right, a bit more breakage. More breakage. Down to a ninety. Gaming professional, I wouldn't say that. Wise Island, Northern Island, not in ETS two. Because it isn't. It's in pro mods, get pro mods. Problem solved. Right, down to a sixty. Yeah, we will be coming back to ETS two. We've taken a break um, from it. Um, we'll maybe come back and uh, do something um, in a really small truck. I confused. Did I say that already? May not have done. Uh, Pro Mods is free. Obviously, you have to have all the DLC. Right, so into Augsburg. Definitely not a very long... That was a noise. A long route between the two of them, is it? So that was a four-line run. some braking and lock right right
there's nobody on the train. There's, there's nobody on here. They've all got off. Should I put some lights on in the train? Is there a button for that? Uncouple. Don't do that. Lounge window opaque control. What? 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 That's quite cool. Passenger doorstep override. That's quite cool. I can make my windows opaque and non opaque. Good work. Now I'll take a break before the next service. Have a Kit Kat. Other chocolate bars are available. Okay. Where am I going to... Do I need to leave the seats? Take a... Oh, no, there we go. Okay. So that was the full line... Uh, back to the main menu. Full line run in the Ice Ice Baby. Um, let's drop commuter confusion power predicament that's in that one S-Bahn shutdown that's only 20 minutes though right, timetable that one which one was it is that one I think wasn't it uh, okay Eastbound to Munich. So Augsburg to Munich. That's what we want then, isn't it? Uh, that's about well, perfect. Well, that, okay, so now we'll take the slow train uh, from Augsburg back to Munich. Which should be just about perfect. Begin. Unlock doors. Oh, hang on, I don't even know where bloody side the platform is. That one. Uh... Am I in a... Forward. Okay. Loading passengers. So, yeah. So, here. Stop at Augsburg. How did you thing? Stop at Augsburg. Somewhere else. Stop at Kissing. Oh, Kissing. Platform 5. You can probably get arrested for that. Uh, Mehring. Mehring. Althen, good thing, what do we call it? Has, Hassel Moor, Mammendorf, München Passing, and then Munich. Okay. Wait until 7.06. Why? Why have I got to wait? We got windows. Here we've got windows. Let's open the windows then. 7.06.30? Okay. We've got lights. Cab light. Let's turn that on headlights put high beams on why not it is a horn lock doors okay let's do that Objective complete. Right, stop at this other place then. Right, so... Oh, God, that was... Okay, so now it's a, uh, a return journey. So we did high-speed run from Munich down to Augsburg. Now we're going to take the commuter train back to Munich. First stop coming up, 900 metres.
Yeah, not a bad uh, DLC. If you like the high speed stuff. I really liked the one I did last time. I can't remember what it was, but it was good. <laughs> it obviously made a lasting impression on me. And that the American one. Is that an American one? I can't remember. Long Island Railroad. That's the one. Yeah, I like that. Nicht Einsteigen. Sounds like a German pop star. Loading passengers. Passengers are being loaded. What's the next Train Sim Mod 2 DLC to look at? Now, there's still a couple I haven't done. Um, that I've got. So I'll have a look at the end. I don't think there's any of the British ones I haven't done. Lock the doors. I am. Oh, lock left. That's making a noise. Objective complete. Now I've done rapid transit. That's definitely a noise. Oh, the French one. I could do France, I suppose. I think I've got it. Right, 2.5k to Augsburg, Hochzoll. So making our way back to uh, Munich. No, Eurostar isn't in this yet. I, at some point, someone will. Because they'll do just the Channel Tunnel, won't they? Well, there is, as far as thingy in there. London to Faversham, high speed. Oh, crap, 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 crap. I didn't really hit the emergency brake, honest. I forgot there was a station. It approached far too fast. Objective complete. Unlock the doors. Those brakes are good. Impressive brake. Oh, I've got, I've got time for a jelly baby. I think I have got time for a jelly baby. I should do a Welsh DLC. Go up in the Wales in the valleys. Yeah, there's no brake patch.
Knocking left. Right, kissing. <laughs> kissing platform five. Yeah, don't buy cheap jelly babies. Jelly babies. Should be Bassets. Or Maynards, whatever they are. I expect to see Dylan and Crispy on the next platform. What, in Germany? Just pop to Germany. <laughs> Platform one to four, get jealous. Well, it's quieter than the ice one, but it's noisier inside. I quite like that. one of your trip report yeah um the way this thing is accelerated it probably do the same speed as the bloody ice train yeah i used to watch your trip reports dylan but as soon as you started speaking in them it put me off Must be the Brummy accent. <laughs> yeah. All right, 1.8k to kissing. You're right, here we are in Paris. Come here, back train. Come here, back train. <laughs> so, <a> Yorkshire. <laughs> I don't know what happened there. Have a look in the Discord, Nico. Right, here we come into kissing. Tongues out. Hang on. Kissing platform five. Where's platforms? I can see two other platforms. What's going on here? Oh, it's one of those where, yeah, three, four, five. Well, it's one and two then. This is just because it's a really long platform. Platform five, Munich. Not, not much kissing happening here. The beach enclosures. What in Germany? Is this double hornage? It's not, is it? No. Single hornage. Lock doors. Uh, Mehring St. Afra, Platform 4, is next. Uh, 
So these are all the places that we whizzed past on the way down from uh, Munich to Augsburg. Might be track five instead of platform five. It said platform five, and it was actually platform five, I think, wasn't it? Where we stopped at. I just didn't know where platforms one and two were. Unless it used to be what is now the high speed line. They may have been in platforms one and two over there. They removed the station, but had to keep it as platforms three, four, and five. Could have been. If someone could find out, that'd be great. Have a Google. What happened to kissing platforms one and two? Carried the rails. That's just... I don't know if that's smart or not, actually. Right, 1.5k to Mering St. Afra Platform 4. Breaking. The brakes are pretty good on this. Breaking. I didn't really like the audio from it. That's a long slanty subway. Yeah, this is platform three and four. So I reckon there used to be another platform over there. Where I'm pointing. Um, what is now the ice? What is now? That's good English, isn't it? Uh, that's now being used by the ice trains. So it used to be platforms one, two, three, four. So they've got rid of one and two, but kept it at three and four. Oh, what have we started? No, of course he's not the same Dylan who does Dylan trip reports. Cause, because if you look at Dylan's trip reports and listen to him talking, which he does now, does it sound like the same Dylan that's on the streams? And how would that same Dylan that travels all over Europe on trains be able to be here for the streams at least four days of the week and if he's not in them he's watching them <sighs> anyway Mering is the next place duplicate Dylan's yeah <laughs> he's cloned himself actually he's not cloned himself he looks completely different I don't think Dylan would be off to Barcelona on a train on his own somehow in fear of getting trapped in the toilet Because in every one of his videos, he does a check of the toilet. That'd be no good, because he didn't let it go in there and we get out again. Right, Mering is... Um, I used to watch it. I used to watch his videos. It's actually quite interesting until he started speaking and it put me off. I shouldn't have done that. Maybe it was my first couple of YouTube videos. Or maybe I think it's the first one. 
is me not speaking. I think the first couple. Perhaps I should just carried on. That'd have been a lot easier, wouldn't it? Into Mering we come. Yeah, I might do the French one next week. Now, I don't think I've done uh, the French, providing I've got it, of course. I can't remember. Uh, if that's the case, then yeah, I'll do that next week. I have to brush up on my uh, Francais. That's squeaky. Une, deux, trois. Une, deux, trois, quatre, cinq, six, neuf, huit, neuf, dix, onze, douze, treize, quatorze, quinze, dix, huit, no, dix, sept, dix, huit. No, as far as I can get. There's some frogs, lives and stuff, snails. No. That's crawl taking the legs off of frogs. How are they supposed to get around? Froggy wheelchair. That wheelchair in the fog. Yeah, so all the slow tracks are like four or five. All the fast tracks would be one, two. But I'm guessing they used to be platforms. So it was a. They just taken away the, the platforms and built a wall. Ice, ice, baby. Does look nice, must admit. Quite like this train. This train's go, it's very trainy. So, Alf, Alfegenim, Egegenim, but the place up there, it says in the top left, is where we're stopping next. Train is very red, very ready train. Uh, no. I had the Creators Club and the other one before they released, obviously. Uh, loaded them, broke my profile, so uninstalled them. Uh, haven't reinstalled them. It's not my thing. It's not a thing I'll be doing. Right, 1.2 of the Ks to go to the place with the place with the top left up there, that place. I can't pronounce that. It's just far too difficult.
about to do some of the breaking thing. And stop. I stopped. Open the doors. Oops. Like the long bloody underpass here, didn't it? Really long slope up there. Where does it come from? Hello. I'd say hello to the people. Oh, locked doors. Uh, Haspel Moor, Platform 4. Yeah, definitely my kind of train. There's just one lever. Yank it all the way that way and you go the forward and yank it all the way back this way and you do the stoppy. Right, 2.5k. One day I will do some more Dr. Bunny. One day. Maybe over Easter, because Bunny. It's not that far away, is it? Four weeks till Easter? Five? Four? Five? Six? Twelve? Hundred and twelve? Some of that. Some, some weeks to Easter. Seventeenth of April, five weeks. I played surgeon sim. No, I really want to do the the second one because that's uh oh uh oh that's uh, multiplayer. Oh, we're fine. We have some issues with playing multiplayer games in the community. Which is why we're doing trucking on Friday. Breaking. Roll the braking. Hey, that's not bad with the whole stopping thing. Unlocking the doors. The doors are being... What the hell? Are they? Okay, it, they're stuck on the step. They can't get out the train. Oh, no, they're okay. Mind the step between the train and the platform. Mind the step. a long-lasting memory of mine from going to London when I was a, a wee boy. Just hearing that. Mind the gap. Objective completed. Mammendorf. 5.9 of the case. Power... So yeah, we will tackle some power wash simulator in multiplayer uh, at some point. Um, difficulty with the multiplayer in that is that we can only do in multiplayer what I've already done in single player. 
So at the moment it's only oh, I'm on my third different space in single player. But I did really enjoy doing that last uh, last Sunday. Five k to go. Yeah, actually, I prefer this train over the ice one. Also, you can see there on the right where there was other tracks as well. Yeah, there is a multiplayer in career mode in Power Wash, but it's only two people. So then you can have two people on the scenario. So we might try and do that um, at some point. And then move up to having like five or six of us. It means we've got to re-go over some of the old ones. That's the problem. Right, we've got an 80 limit in 2.3k. I think someone said when I was doing it that there's um, a couple of scenarios that are like in single player would take you four hours to do. Uh, that or that from the outside All right 1.1 K It's actually not a bad run. I think it's almost too quick doing it in the ice train. And the train going the other way. So it's staggered. Uh, yeah, staggered-ish platform here. Breaking. Some of the braking, more of the braking. Ah, that's close enough. Unlock left. It's like a long walk to get out of the station. You go all the way down there, down the subway, across to the left, I'm guessing, and then back in. It's a fair old way. lock the doors oh lock left i need to unlock the other side and do that people get off and fall on the tracks uh munich passing 23k now okay so a bit of a trek ahead of us all right so we've got 160 section coming up 
So is that, that's pretty much the same limit for this as it was for the ice train along here then. Wait for the limit to change. Come on, get the train through the thing. There we go. All right, power. being German it doesn't say like on the British stuff what the maximum speed is of the train but I reckon that based on this already well actually no speed limit oh, speed thingy yeah. and it goes up to 180 uh, boomer days thank you very much for the follow welcome to insanity as I turned my audio down for the announcement because some fools kept playing the stupid bloody music yesterday all right so flat out 156 ish 157 okay nearly 156 got a German autobahn no limit well that's only in certain places it's not all of it though there's only certain restricted sections by right, 18k and then it's what about 7k then back to Munich after that yeah not a bad route actually quite sure bit like you know Nico train and crispy um, but yeah it's actually quite nice quite a lot of detail I, I like the trains I, I prefer this one to the ice one if I'm honest because the ice one seems a bit underutilized Hey, we're not on the farm. Where's that go? That goes down, or that one goes up, and over there. K to go and then it's 7k back to Munich yeah not a bad line we'll have got another one next week uh, I don't think if I've got the French one I don't, certainly haven't done the French high speed one so that'll be quite a good comparison quite a good back to back as it were Uh oh, we got a Lello. If the next one's red, we're completely screwed. Okay, yeah, 1.6k. Braking. All of the all of the braking.
Right, 500 uh, meters and we got a red. Okay, brakes are okay on this. Is that going to change before we actually stop? That is the question. It's not looking good, is it? I can't see it changing. We're going to have to stop. I lost a bit and it will troll me now and as soon as I stop it will change to green. It's bound to happen. Hi Aiden. Okay, what's ticking? <laughs> Why is the train ticking? It's over there. Hang on, what are these flashing for? Oh, because it stopped. It thought I wanted to open the doors. Ah, I was like, what the hell is that noise coming from? Which got to... Should I find... Did that work? No, that's not making them change. No, hooting at them doesn't make them change. I'll try it again just in case. So what are we waiting for? There must be... There's no trains around. Why... Why are we the ones that are held up here? Do you not realise we've got places to get to, places to be? Where is the horn coming from? I'm trying to sleep. Stop giving me the horn. That sounded a bit wrong. A contact signaler. Denied. Wait for signal to change. Okay, all right. No, you may not cross through the signal. It's on danger. You must wait for the lights to change to green. I was just asking. I need to get so touchy. I found that there's just nothing else around. It's like, nope, we're going to keep you there now. And it was all going so well. Really? It did nothing. Nothing. There's not. There's nothing around. There's no other. The, the trains. There's none of them. I'm trying to think where it would be, unless it's coming from. If I've got to go up there and round to the right, unless there's something coming from the left that's going to cut across and go down that line there into that platform behind me. I think that's the only reason that it's holding me. So there's going to be a train that's cutting across. No, there's no buffet car. No, we don't serve coffee. Is 
as this is Germany, we shall only drink schnapps. About rum. That's Jamaican. Germans don't drink rum. Brandy schnapps. I used to like peach schnapps. I went for a phase of drinking peach schnapps. That was quite nice. <laughs> There's definitely, like, nothing happening. No, vodka. That'll go up in price soon. It be cheaper to put that in your car rather than put petrol in. Um... And I'd wait for signal to change. But it's not changing. <laughs> I think it's just forgotten about me. Unless this scenario's completely uh, knackered. Definitely nothing else around. I'll try creeping forward a little bit. And honk out again. Hang on, I see a train. There's a train, there's a train to come in. It's on that line to my right though. Why would that be stopping me? It wouldn't be. Unless it's come from where I've got to go. Nope, but it wasn't that then, was it? See, logically, it would be coming from the left and then cutting across in front of me. Oh, hang on. Unless I have to wait for this ice train to pass. Once that goes through the next signal, maybe. I don't know. I'm, I'm thinking broken. Oh, no, hang on. Hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. It was that bloody ice train. We were probably sat there, it was still back there in bloody Augsburg. Still got 11k to go. Uh, this is, this uh, route's been out a while. But it's my first time looking at it. So it, it made us wait there all that time just for an ice train to come through. Blimey.
uh, yeah, I am late a little bit. Right, 1.9k and we got a 160 limit. Not that that's going to worry me anyway. An 8.5k to uh, Munich passing, pacing. Not bad uh, DLC, this. Don't mind it at all. Oh, we got another bloody yellow. Don't keep mucking me about. Oh, we're on a green. We're okay. No, it's not a hype train. Or hyped train. A train to Hypesville. Right, so 5.2 to the next stop. 3.8, 3.6. So we've got to reduce speed. Ooh, that's some lag. Oh god, another yellow coming up needs to be a pacer. I might do another pacer trip over Easter. Right, don't give me a red. Don't give me a red. Don't give me a red. Please don't give me a red. Green. Okay. Right, let's slow it down towards our 130. Yeah, I was going to use the thumper for my uh, long trip we did previously. Um, Penzance to Paddington, but uh, decided to go with a pacer in the end. It's become a yearly tradition now. I'm sure we'll do another one this Christmas. red 1.1k okay that's some um, quite impressive brakes could that take days no, I think this year, because we've done, um, we've done Edinburgh to, what have we done? We've done Paddington to Penzance in a pacer, Edinburgh to London in a pacer, Penzance to Paddington in a pacer, stopping at less stops. So I think this year it needs to be London to Edinburgh in a pacer, stopping at less stops. rather than all the stops that we did on the way down. All right, 200 metres. To our red. Which hopefully now... This doesn't keep us hanging around here for a while. No, I don't think we can do use into Glasgow in one hit. That's the problem. It's not all linked. You can't you can't do it, Captain. Uh... Yeah, but it's only supposed to be a forty two minute scenario. And that was like 50 minutes ago. It's, I'm not opening and closing the doors. 
And we've still got to get to Munich. Oh, there we go. Alright, 1.2k. That's fine. That's half to Munich. Alright, Munich pacing platform 9. Yeah, quite liking the DLC. Oh, that's a view change. All right, in we come. Squeaky brakes. Objective completed. Unlock the left doors. Doors are being unlocked. Oh, they can't get off the train, can they? They don't like that. Oh, oh there you go. Yeah, there's a bit of a gap between the need I need to lower down the platform thing, just shave a bit off, or need to like raise the track up a bit. So I could go and work for German Railways, stop people tripping up on the uh, exit of the train. Lock doors. complete right stop at Munich right hopefully now we get greens all the way into Munich call Ed the health and safety officer be too drunk Right, just keep the green lights, that's what we want. Yep, we're okay in a minute. Considering this is just a commuter train, it actually uh, accelerates okay. Right, so we've got a 60 in 3 kilometres. It's definitely getting a little bit laggy now as we're getting towards uh, Munich. Yeah, quite a good DLC. Not a bad route. Prefer this, the uh, the slower commuter train, than the other one. Oh, 
Alright, so slowing it down towards that 60. our way back into Munich so that was the whole line we've done uh, on the ice train going from Munich down to Augsburg and then the whole line run back from Augsburg uh, back to Munich again including a trip for a, um, a train wash well, we've got a 40 coming up now A pacer is the fastest train known to man. <laughs> you can call. Well, slap my thigh and call me Susan. 30. There is Susan. He said his name was Susan. Yeah, we'll have a look to see if I've got the, um, the French one. And if I have, we'll do that next week so we can compare fast trains. He never called me back. He still hasn't called me back. Oh, Susan. That's a lot of train lines. Train can hop out the ground over there. Where did the that come from? I was young. It was dark. He said that's where he was keeping his lunch. What t-shirt am I wearing? Oh, am I wearing my Noodly Boo t-shirt today? I was wearing my I Was Young, It Was Dark over the weekend. Can't forget my frog's legs. It may help drive the train. Am I in a man? No, it was earlier. And pretty much everyone in that video is no longer part of the community. People come, people go. Lord. Yeah. Unlock doors. Four years, seven months. So, no, just after that video came out then. Seems longer. I can't believe at times I've been doing this as long as I have. Madness, total madness. Locked doors. Objective complete.
there we go. So, um, yeah, five speed run down uh, and then um, normal run uh, back. That was actually quite good. Uh, let's go and get some audio. Hang on. There we go. Um, so there we go. So that was... Wasn't that one. So what are we just done? Uh, that one. That's one we just done. Munich to Augsburg. Um, I've got that. I don't think I've done that one. Actually, I might have done. I don't think I've got the uh, the French one then. No, I've got the French one. I might do. I might swing British next week. Maybe like the Cathcart Circle Line or something like that again. Um, or do um, like West uh, West Somerset slow, isn't it? Like Northern Trans Pennine or Tees Valley, something like that. Actually, East Coastway is quite good. We'll do something in the UK uh, next week. Um, but yeah, that was... Um, I've lost where we were now. Where were we? I've just gone past it. There it is. Uh, so yes, there we go. Uh, more trains back next week then. Uh, next stream though, back tomorrow night with some idiots to do some farming. Uh, and then Friday night, uh, got some American trucking. Uh, Saturday lunchtime, some tourist bus. Saturday night will be more farming. And then Sunday afternoon, uh, more power washing of stuff. Uh, now I've got my Stegosaurus clean. We can progress on from there. Uh, thanks to you lot in chat then for keeping me company uh, for the last uh, two and a bit hours. Uh, and to uh, this lot. It does work. Uh, to uh, Stu and Trent for the bits. Uh, to uh, Dylan and Nightbot for doing some moderation and to boomer days for following uh, thank you very much uh, indeed i will be back then with some idiots uh, tomorrow night uh, for some farming until then if you have been thanks very very much for watching <laughs>